Milan, what did um, what did you guys learn about yourself? I mean, you think you've lost twice in your last nine games, but what did you learn just in terms of the way you guys compete against Houston? Get down early, come back, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Yeah, I mean, obviously we knew it was going to be a really good game. Um, we expected to win. That's the mentality we came in with. Um, but it kind of just showed we can hang with anyone in the country. Um, we're one of the best teams in the country. Um, and we just learned to come out a little faster, um, dug ourselves in a little bit of a hole there. And then um, just keep playing for one another, um, keep defending, and then um, keep moving on offense. How have teams shifted the way they defend you as you've continued to make big shots and big opportunities and flashing doubles at you at times? I mean, what's the adjustment been like knowing that that was probably going to happen? Yeah, uh, they're just sticking a little close to me on the perimeter, um, not letting me get any rhythm threes, and then just really just being as physical as they can with me. Um, that's kind of the scout. No open threes and just be physical with them. Milan, the physicality of, of this league, is it more than what you expected? What you expected and how have you adapted to it? Uh, I would say it's what I expected just because um, everyone talks about how physical this league is. So I came in with the mentality that it's going to be physical and um, I got to adjust to it. Um, and I, I adapted to it um, pretty well so far. Um, I just think just keep going every day in practice um, and adapting to it that way um, because I still got room to improve a lot. Curtis, I think in each of the last two games, you've dove on the floor for a loose ball. I think the game here, you could hear your knee scrape against the hardwood. So first of all, how's your knee doing? Um, but second of all, when did that buy-in kind of come for you um, in terms of you know, trying to make those effort plays? Uh, my knee doing all right. It got a few. <laughs> <laughs> it got uh some scratches on it, but you know, as a part of the game, um, that buy-in came probably when we got here. You're forced to buy in, so pretty much ever since I got here, I say it's been like that. Get on the floor, some TJ emphasizes, and you know, we have a segment in film uh, that's about getting on the floor. So it's a big emphasis for our team. You talked about you know being forced upon you guys um, to play that way on the defensive side and for loose balls. How does that? about like how are you forced to do that is that drills is that conversations with the staff like how has that come about uh, it comes about in like practice when we're let's say the ball is a loose ball and you don't get on the floor you're probably gonna get chewed out a little bit about not getting on the floor so you don't want to get chewed out so i'd rather get on the floor than get chewed out so i would say that's pretty much where that uh emphasis comes in Either one of you guys, neither of you were here on last year's team, but what have the veterans kind of told you about this West Virginia team that beat them twice last year and once at Hilton? Uh, I know they got five guys back from that team, and they swept the team last year. Uh, TJ's kind of been talking about, so got to get them back for that, you know, and get back in that win column versus West Virginia. So and I know they might not have the best record in the league, but we're still looking at it like it's a big game. Curtis, TJ said one of the aspects of your, I guess not game, but personality is your poise out there. Everything's flying, as physical as things are. Have you always had that? Or do you even have that? Are you masking <laughs> something? I mean, because, you know, he pointed that out as a, as, a, as a big plus for you. Yeah, I say I've always had it, but sometimes it takes me a bit to get adjusted to things, like at every level. Um, when I went to junior college, it took me a while to get adjusted. And then once I did, you know, I was poised. And same thing at Buffalo. And now I think uh, you can see it here. So once I get adjusted, and I always get adjusted wherever I'm at, um, that's when it tends to you can really see it.